Good morning, Southeast students and staff. Today's Thriving Thursday, January 13th. I'm Mr. Z. Remember, successful Spartans are respectful. They follow school and classroom-wide expectations and allow for learning throughout our building. Our building. Yours. Mine. Ours. Now, if you would, join me for a moment of silence. Thank you. So it's Thriving Thursday, and we're kicking this semester off with a throwback theme. Yeah, that's one I've used before. It's get organized. We need to set up right so that the rest of the semester can be as easy as possible. Last semester, every Spartan got a new planner. If you don't have one, I already spoke to Mr. Trigger. Go see him. We talked about the fact, that's an F-A-C-T fact, not an alternative fact, not an opinion, a real fact is that students who use planners earn higher grades, so they do better in school. They have higher rates of graduation, well duh, they do better in school with less effort, and they also report less stress related to managing school assignments. So I do better, I perform better, and I have less stress. Use the dang planners. Plus, I mean, we're freaking paying you for it. Let's go. Anyway, so how do you use them? Well, there's five easy steps. One, you always gotta have it with you. Remember, it's your only hall pass and you really can win real money for it. Two, use a bookmark or a paper clip. I like the paper clips, they don't fall out and I always leave it to the scheduled week so I can flip it open and close it without having to shuffle. Number three, write your subjects in scheduled order going down the side. And number four, this is important, record both the class topic what we talk about today and the assignment. It'll help you remember your notes, perhaps upcoming tests. Regardless, you want to have a good record of what was done. And finally, five, this is my favorite part. This is where achievement comes in. Mark off, check off, cross off, highlight, tear later page out. I don't care, but mark off completed assignments. It feels good and helps you keep track of making sure you have completed and submitted all your work. Seniors, you better be rested. 2022 is here. Yeah, Monday was hard to wake up, but you better be up now because it is your time to shine. Have you applied to college, trade school, military? If not, you gotta stop by and see Mr. Nazo in room 121, the college room, or follow up with the representatives during that, that Mr. Nazo arranges to come in during your lunch. Free money's there, guys. Scholarships are open. Check your school email or Canvas announcement for links to over 23,000. Dang, that's a lot of scholarships. Hope you know how to use control V and control P. But anyway, there's even some local only scholarships through the Community Foundation. So if you want free money, apply today. And if you've not finished your FAFSA yet, do that too. It is graduation requirement. Our goal is to be offered more than $9 million in free scholarships. So let's see how much free money you can get. Let's go Southeast seniors. Students who have free bus passes, please pick them up in the main office. City's around the corner. We got city shirts coming. You can prepay now in room 103 or after school. There's three different shirts. Those are 30 bucks total or one shirt for 12. Any questions, see Ms. Barsick. Speaking of Ms. Barsick and the student council, City Spirit Week is upon us. Here's your themes for next week. Tuesday is twin day. Pair up and match fits with your best twinny. Wednesday, what do you mean? What do I mean? It's meme day. Represent your favorite school appropriate internet meme. Thursday, hey children of the 80s, let's get ready to show out. Oh wait. All you guys were born in this century. Well, Thursday's Decades Day. Pick your favorite decade from history and dress up to represent it. And Friday, you already know what day it is. It's my favorite. It's Blue and Gold Day. Ooh, I hope we get to march with the band. Ooh, I hope we get to see the palms and cheerleaders do their first floor loop. Please, 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 please. Anyway, that's your Spirit Week next week. Remember, Unity Day in 2022, 2022 is right around the corner. Sign up Wednesday through Friday in the Commons during either lunch period to attend. Unity Day will take place before City Tournament Games on January 22nd from 11 to 1 p 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. at the BOS Center. Fun games, foods, and prizes. And who knew? Penny Wars are also coming. Tuesday, January 11th. Well, that was yesterday. Through next Tuesday, help the Superintendent's Roundtable raise money to support Compass for Kids in the run-up to the City Tournament and Unity Day. Starting Tuesday, I want everyone to participate in Penny Wars in their first hour. The first hour class that raises the most money by next Tuesday will have a donut breakfast party brought to you by Mr. Trigg. Donut, let Mr. Trigg down. Ah? I always find a way to get a dad joke in there. Come on. 
from the desk of Miss Metz. Attention 10th grade students, if you're planning to attend CACC next year, please see Miss Metz in the guidance office as soon as possible. She'll be coming by to visit English classes as well. But get that form from your English teacher and get it submitted. Uh, we'll see you in the 11th grade. Better pass this semester first. Any juniors or seniors interested in teaching as a career, please see Ms. Metz about a dual credit opportunity uh, your junior and senior year to get your college career started in the field of education while you're still at Southeast. That would be sick. And now, some fellow Spartans to tell you about the Southeast game night. You might remember us from... Just as a reminder, join us January 27th in the Commons from 3.30 to 5, open to all students and staff. Games, pizza, and prizes, brought to you by the, the Spartan, Spartan Union. Union. Thanks, Spartan Union. Can't wait to see how this game night goes. Please stand now for a Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, Spartans, go have a great day.